Hi, my name's Stuart MacDonald and I'm a Professor of Law at Swansea University. For my Cherish project, I worked with colleagues at Swansea University and Cardiff University to study how the so-called Islamic State tried to disseminate its online magazine on Twitter. To do this, for a three-week period after the release of each new issue, we collected all tweets that mentioned the magazine. These tweets were then subjected to quantitative and qualitative analysis. Three of our key findings were, first of all, because of Twitter's aggressive suspension activity against IS sympathisers, IS had been forced to rely on the creation of new Twitter accounts to disseminate new issues of its magazine. As a result, these accounts had relatively low numbers of followers and they were suspended before they gained much of a following. Second, we uncovered evidence of the use of botnets to try and disseminate the magazine. And third, we found that outlinking was an important part of IS's dissemination strategy. This involved using Twitter as a gateway to other smaller platforms that lack the capacity or the willingness to regulate the content on their platforms as effectively. Well, the research has had some important impact. First, it helped identify online terrorist content that we were able to then refer to the relevant tech company so that it could be removed from the internet. Second, it raised the awareness of smaller tech companies of how their services might be exploited by terrorist groups. And this encouraged them to engage with knowledge sharing and capacity building initiatives to try and increase their resilience against terrorist exploitation. So thank you very much to Cherish for their support for this research project.